Welcome back, I'm out here. And I have my 150cc carbide go-kart here. Just gonna do a quick little walk around of it. I'll tell you what I did. So first of all, this is not the original engine. The people I bought it off of had run it out of oil and the piston actually melted to the walls. So it had very little to no compression, wouldn't start. So I spent a thousand bucks on a new engine. It's a hammerhead performance engine. So it goes pretty fast. I've hit 70, 72 kilometers per hour on it. I need new tires because the people who bought it off of bagged it. They didn't take care of it. They're practically bald. There's nothing left of them. And they spray painted it this ugly color. I've they spent 3500 bucks on it. Some say cost brand new. And then just spray bombed it. So I'm spray painting it while well, I sanded it. Spray painted it black. Still got to do the top part there in the back. I added these LED lights. They cost 15 bucks for the two of them. I added a winch, thousand pound winch, is 50 bucks, like on sale or something like that. And let's see, I'll turn on the lights for you guys here. So they're pretty bright in the winter time. Not bad. The winch works pretty good. It's not bad. So yeah, that's basically all I have to say of it. It's pretty fun. I'll make a video of it in the summertime here. Bought a new battery for it. New carb. New everything at the engine pretty much except the exhaust and the gas tank. Otherwise everything's new in the back end. So, that's basically it. Has forward, neutral, and reverse. And the uh, steering pivots up and down. So say, if you're taller and you have to stick your knees up, you can just lift that up. It has, I'm not sure what kind of steering you call this, but proportional or something like that. So it's geared down, so it steers really easy. There's really good suspension on it. it. Starts up fairly easy. Let's see if it'll start here. Doesn't like starting when it's warm. There we go. Starts really easy when it's cold. Sounds pretty good though. For 150. And then you have the little safety shutoff switch back here. Not quite sure what that's exactly for, but yeah, that's about it. Just a little view of my carbide go kart. 150 has a GY6 engine in it with a reverse transmission. Okay, I'll see you guys next time and have a good day.